You may now be seated. Good morning, family, friends, faculty and staff, and distinguished guests. Welcome to the commencement ceremony of Cross Creek Early College High School's class of 2023. I am Lakeisha Bradley McCabe, Assistant Principal at Cross Creek. Graduation from high school is a milestone in the life of a student and his or her family. The dignity of the occasion can be best observed by refraining from whistling, yelling, or applauding for any one student. This will allow families to hear the name of their graduate. Your congratulations can be shown by applause for the total group after the turning of the tassel. We also ask for your cooperation in taking pictures. No one should leave their seat to take a picture or video. It is an honor to introduce to you our distinguished guests. I ask our guests to please stand upon my introduction. Members of the Cumberland County Board of Education, Deanna Jones, Board Chair. Jacqueline Brown. Alicia Chisholm. Carrie Sutton. Donna Van. Greg West. Susan Williams. From Cumberland County Schools, we have Dr. Marvin Connolly, Jr., Superintendent of Cumberland County Schools. Dr. Melody Chalmers McLean, Associate Superintendent of Student Support Services. Kevin Coleman, Associate Superintendent of Auxiliary Services. Dr. Jane Fields, Associate Superintendent of School Support Services. Dr. Malata Hill, Chief Academic Officer for Academic Services. Ruben Reyes, Associate Superintendent of Human Resources. Nick Soika, Board Attorney. Jay Tolan, Associate Superintendent of Business Operations. Dr. Lindsley Whitley, Associate Superintendent of Communications and Community Engagement. Dr. Christina Catalano, Assistant Superintendent of K-12 Curriculum and Instruction. Dr. Tanjay Robertson, Area Superintendent of School Support. And from Cross Creek Early College High School, we have Chris Qualley, Principal. Gina Hickel, School Counselor. The valedictorian for the class of 2023, 
Nathaniel Heath, and co-salutatorians for the class of 2023, John Fordage and Jonathan Ross. At this time, we will hear from our principal, Chris Squally. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to this special event. I would like to take this opportunity to thank all the teachers and staff who are committed to the success of all of our students and take a personal interest in their academics and social growth. I would also like to thank the parents, guardians, family, and friends supporting these individuals throughout the years and helping them develop into such amazing individuals. To the class of 2023, it is with great honor to stand before you as your principal. I hope each of you have signed in today when you arrived. Today is a special day, and one of them, one of that you have most of you have been anticipating since you first started school. As you sit in your cap and gown, I want you to think about all the wonderful things you have accomplished and experienced so far. All of, all of you have completed numerous college courses that will catapult you into your next journey. You will face many obstacles through your journey, you have, you have, but you have learned at Cross Creek how to overcome them and advocate for yourself. Just know that each of you will be missed, and I wish you all the best of luck in your future. This senior class will always have a special place in my heart. Now, as you sit nervously in your chair, anticipating your name being called, I want you to each take a deep breath, relax, and just take it all in. I want you to know how extremely proud and excited I am for each of you. Although I was only with you for two years, I feel like I know you all very well. I can stand here and say something great about each of you, but that would put me over on time. Many of you will be going off to college. Some of you will be entering the workforce. Whatever you decide to do, enjoy every minute of it. Time goes by way fast. I'm sure you've heard your parents say, it seems like yesterday I just brought you home, or it seems like I was just dropping you off at kindergarten. Use every moment you have to, the best, to be the best version of yourself and never settle for anything less. Be proud of yourself and who you have grown into be and always do the best you can. And if you need a getaway or some stress relief, my recommendation is Angry Birds Candy Crush. As you face challenges in life, I want you to use the skills you've learned to persevere through. Make good choices and always keep your eyes on the prize. The prize may vary or change from time to time, and that is okay. But you always have a prize or an end goal. In a few moments, each of you will be receiving your high school diploma. Your diploma will provide you with many opportunities. This is your prize for now. So I want each of you to leave here with high expectations. Don't let anyone or anything stand in your way. And one last time, don't forget to sign out. Congratulations. At this time, I would like to introduce John Fordich, one of our co-salutatorians of the class of 2023. Good morning, fellow graduates, family, friends, and faculty on this wonderful day as we celebrate the accomplishments of all the graduating students of Cross Creek Early College High School who have persevered through these past four years and made it to the light at the end of the tunnel. If there was one thing I learned from my time at Cross Creek, it is that perseverance is the greatest trait and one that we all have surely learned from these high school and college classes. That is not to say as we did it alone, as of course parents, administrators, and the wonderful teachers of Cross Creek have waded through the waters with us and guided us to where we are today. I would like to extend gratitude on behalf of all the seniors to those that have supported us through every step of the way, believed in us, and helped provide the hope to look onward. I would like to extend special thanks to my parents who have supported me for the past 17 years, for all the sacrifices they have made, and for everything they have done. Thank you. As we conclude this momentous day, let us carry with us the invaluable lessons of perseverance and use the unwavering support we received from our loved ones and educators as fuel to propel us forward in our respective journeys. May the memories we all share at Cross Creek continue to inspire and drive us as we chase our dreams. And may we all find success and fulfillment in the future endeavors that await us. Best of luck to each and every one of you.
I would now like to introduce our next salutatorian, Jonathan Ross. Good morning. To begin, on behalf of all the graduates here today, I would like to thank the parents, teachers, and staff. Your dedication to your children and students has led them to be where they are today, and I am sure they would not have been able to get here without you. The past four years have been a long journey for us. Think back to the first day on campus where you stepped on not knowing what to expect. The first few months were difficult as we all adjusted to our new schedules, new teachers, and classmates we had never met before. Just as we had gotten used to life at Cross Creek, that balance would be completely overturned by the pandemic. For over an entire school year, we would be completing our classes online. Even in our final two years, we still had to adjust to making our schedules for college level classes, maintaining our grades in those classes, and most recently, planning the next steps after high school. The reason I mention all of this is because there is one point I wanna leave here today. If there is anything that you take back from these past four years, let it be this. No matter what situation you are in, you can overcome it. Despite everything I've mentioned, from coming into a completely new school environment, having to sit through a pandemic, working on assignments well into the night, practicing speeches and presentations for projects, and applying for colleges and scholarships, you are here right now graduating. You've made deep connections with your classmates and teachers. You've made it through all of those classes you've been stressing about. Even in those difficult times, we've had festivals, homecomings, proms, and so many other times we can look back on as some of the best parts of our time at Cross Creek. If we can do all of these things, then what can stop us now? No matter what situation you might be in, even if you think there is no possible way you can overcome it, I want you to look back at these past four years and realize you can make it through anything. Thank you, and go Cavaliers. I would like now to introduce our valedictorian of class of 2023, Nathaniel Heath. Family members, friends, educators, and leaders, what an honor to stand in front of you as we unite and celebrate in the class of 2023. Today, we can confidently say that we have survived the many sleepless nights freshman year, a pandemic, and personal battles unheard and unsaid. Before I attempt to recapitulate these past four years and how they have shaped and redefined us, I want the graduates to pause for a moment to look around. As you glance around the room, you will see future change makers, doctors, lawyers, and entrepreneurs alike. You will see psychologists, screenwriters, computer scientists, and political officers. But above all, you will see those who have persevered alongside you throughout an integral stage in your life. We have not only acquired knowledge, but also formed profound and lasting connections with our peers, creating a support system that will endure long after our time together. Our journey has been nothing short of remarkable. Friendships forged during our time together have become pillars of strength. So please join me in taking it all in before we have to watch each other's lives in pictures and remember how it felt to be right there with them. We have laughed, cried, and celebrated countless milestones side by side. These bonds were not formed overnight, but were built on shared experiences, mutual trust, and unwavering support. To my friends, I would like to say thank you. Thank you for always believing in me and allowing me to be myself. Thank you for the spontaneous hangouts on the most random days at the most random times. And most of all, thank you for just being there. I'm so proud of who we have become and where we are headed. To my loved ones, my parents, Miss Brenda, Aunt Carolyn, and my little brother, Joel, I love you all dearly. The memories we have created, the relationships we have developed, and the skills we have garnered will forever be a part of our personal and professional growth. As we take our next steps, we hold the belief that our time together was not just a chapter in our lives, but the foundation upon which we will build our futures. To Cross Creek's class of 2023, I offer my sincerest congratulations. Before we part, I encourage you all to keep in touch with those who have and will continuously love and support you. Be your authentic self and know that that is enough. Take the lessons you have learned here and build on them. And finally, hold on to the memories and they will hold on to you. Thank you.
At this time, Ms. Hickel, our school counselor, will present the Latin honors for the class of 2023. We would now like to recognize students for their outstanding academic achievement during their four years at Cross Creek Early College High School. These students have earned the distinction of graduating with honors by achieving a GPA designation within the Latin Honors System. Students graduating cum laude, please stand. These students have achieved an overall GPA of 3.75 to 3.99. Congratulations to these students. You may be seated. <laughs> students graduating magna cum laude, please stand. These students have achieved an overall GPA of 4.0 to 4.249. Congratulations to these students. You may be seated. Students graduating summa cum laude, please stand. These students have achieved an overall GPA of 4.25 and higher. Congratulations to these students. You may be seated. It is now time to present the graduates for the class of 2023. As the graduates come forward, we remind you that the dignity of the occasion can best be observed by standing when your graduate's name is called and by congratulating all the graduates after the tassels have been turned. This will allow all families to hear the name of their graduate. Guillermo Samuel Acivas II. Jarellis Desiree Balcaceres. Aiden Thomas Beiser. Tyleek Omerion Blackledge. Zaria Rache Blue Hardy. Malik Vincent Brock. Tanaya Nicole Brooks. Maria Simone Brown. Faith Laura Bullard. Janaira Leilani Damonet Burgess. Anna Gabriella Caratini Cruz. Hajalia Adania Costin. Melvin Charles Cox, Jr. Amaya Janae Crooks. Beckham Alexander Cruz. Anaya Regine Damron. McKinley George Esslinger, Jr. Brianna Sharice Evans. John Andre Ballo Fortich. Mm -hmm. 
Nigel Sebastian Gonzalez. Kavana Shiree Goodson. Nathaniel Akeem Heath. Jenna Lee Hodges. Alicia Ann Huggins. Kristen Rainey Johnson. Devin Hunter Kennedy. Alex Leo Classy. Sesheyon Oluwadara Kublenu. Jamie Molena Leon. Taylor Amaya Lipscomb. Milian Teresa Maldonado. Nathaniel Douglas Mishaw. Kira Ray Mueller. Tiani Janae Boro Nap Napati. Kyle Angelo Alado Olan. Kamari Garyell Pemberton. Audria Maya Perry. V. Fong Pham. Rene Joseph Pintac de Venegracia. Miriam Zupora Rigel. Jonathan Edward Ross. Nairi Simone Silva. Nicholas Miles Singletary. Amber Dawn Smith. Deondias Zion Stevens. Hunter Kalhimawana Kapiliala Thaxton. Alexander Nicholas Thompson. Quindlin Diane Tillman. Ashley Azanet Valenzuela Diaz. Florian Lugor Vaney. Jada K. Nicola Watson. Stephanie Danielle Watson. Imani Zania Weidman.
Victoria D'Avion Mycenae Williams. Michael DeAndre Wilson, Jr. Natalia Olivia Yarrell. Anaya Tula Zolfikar. Class of 2023, it is my pleasure to announce that you have met the graduation requirement set forth by the North Carolina Department of Public Instruction and the Cumberland County Board of Education. You may turn your tassel.